Hi everyone! Today I'll be teaching you how to convert a price from a source currency to a destination currency in Power Automate. This is a quick and easy process that can improve international interactions with just one step. As a reminder, this will work the same way in Logic Apps as well. To perform this flow, we will be using a Cloud Immersive Currency Conversion Connector. Now, to get things started, we will click Create. On this page, we will choose Instant Cloud Flow, type in a name for the flow, select Manually Trigger a Flow, and press Create. Now, we're ready to begin. The first and only step of our process is selecting the Price Conversion function. To do this, we will look up the Cloud Immersive Currency Conversion Connector, which is the greenish-blue icon here. You can see we have a couple other options for getting exchange rates or a list of available currencies, but for this demonstration, we will select Convert a Price from the Source Currency into the Destination Currency. Note that if you've never used one of our connectors before, you will be prompted to enter your API key. This is free on the CloudMersive website with no commitment, and once you've entered it here, you won't be asked for it again. Now we will add the source currency ISO code, the destination currency ISO code, and the price we wish to convert. I'm doing a simple conversion between dollars and euros with the example price listed in the box, but this can be performed with many different currencies. Once this information is filled out, we can click the Save button at the bottom of the screen. It will take a moment to save your information, but once it's complete, we can click the Test button in the top right-hand corner. We will choose the manual option for testing the file, hit the second test button, and then continue. After that, we will click Run Flow and Done. After clicking Done, we will see green check marks next to all of the connectors showing that the flow worked. Now, we can simply click on the action step to view our results. We can see we have our converted price, the destination currency ISO code, the currency symbol, and the price formatted as a string. That's it for today. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe and check back in for more tutorials and tips on using Cloudmersive connectors in Power Automate.